At the end of this topic, you will be able to define what digestion is, distinguish intracellular digestion from extracellular digestion, appreciate the engulfing mechanism of white blood corpuscles, amoeba, paramecium, etc. Mention the parts of human digestive system, analyze the importance of accessory digestive glands, name the medical speciality related with digestive system. Digestion is a process of mechanical and chemical breakdown of complex food into simpler components which are easily absorbed and assimilated by the body. Intracellular digestion. The food is directly taken into the cells and digested within the cell and it is a primitive type of digestion. WBC, otherwise called as leukocytes in vertebrate body, engulfs the invaded germs by producing pseudopodia around them and digests it by phagocytosis. Phagocytosis is a process of changing the shape of a cell for engulfing the encountered microbes. Amoeba, a unicellular animalcule, possesses pseudopodia to engulf the diatoms and other minute organisms and digest them within the cell. Protozoans, paramecium, swallows the microorganisms in water with the help of a cytoplasmic depression called cytopharynx and digest them within the cells. Animals like sponges and salinitrates carry on intracellular digestion through the alimentary canal like structure has developed in them. Extracellular digestion is a complex and evolved type of digestion. Digestion takes place in alimentary canal with the help of digestive juices secreted from the digestive glands. As the digestion takes place outside the cell and within the space or lumen of the alimentary canal, it is called as extracellular digestion. Digestion in human beings is extracellular. Food is a source of energy and very essential item to build a body tissue and to repair the damaged tissues, chemical reactions and other life processes. Complex food is converted into simple food via the process of digestion to gain energy. The gastrointestinal tract is a long muscular tube about 9 meters in length. It starts from the mouth and ends in the anus in a sequence of mouth, buccal cavity, pharynx, esophagus, stomach, small intestine, large intestine, rectum and anus. Gastroenterology is the medical speciality that deals with the structure, function, diagnosis and treatment of diseases of stomach and intestine. Digestive System in Man A person sitting at a dining table and eating food. Food is taken in through the mouth. You can see the digestive system of humans on the screen. At first, the food is chewed in the mouth. Salivary glands in the mouth pour saliva in the oral cavity. Food is then swallowed. Muscular movement in the esophagus, which helps in the movement of food from the esophagus into the stomach. Food is accumulated in the stomach and gets churned due to the contraction of muscular walls. The partially digested food is then passed in to the small intestine. Inside the small intestine, the end products of digestion are absorbed. Then, the food is moved to the large intestine. Water is reabsorbed from the residual material here. The waste materials then pass to the anus after temporarily being stored in the rectum. The anus pushes the waste materials out of the body. More details regarding the digestive system. The job of your teeth is to grind and chew your food. Inside your mouth, there are structures called glands. These glands make liquid called saliva, which is mixed with your food to help it slip down. Digestion is a laborious process carried out in a stepwise manner with the help of enzymes, otherwise known as biocatalysts, secreted from the digestive glands such as salivary glands, pancreas, liver, etc. In this topic, you have learned Food is a source of energy, build a body tissue, 
damage the repaired tissues, etc. Digestion is a process of converting complex food into simpler substances which in turn absorbed and assimilated by the body. There are two types of digestion, namely intracellular digestion and extracellular digestion. The food is directly taken into the cells and digested within the cell is called intracellular whereas in extracellular digestion, the digestion takes place in alimentary canal. Intracellular digestion is seen in WBC of vertebrate animals, amoeba, paramecium, sponges and coelenterates. Digestion in human beings is extracellular and there are number of digestive glands such as liver, pancreas etc. and its secretions involved in digestion. Gastroenterology is the medical speciality that deals with the structure, function, diagnosis and treatment of diseases of stomach and intestine.